At first sight, Bayawan looks like many provincial towns in the Philippines. But this small city of 115,000 people on the coast of Negros Oriental is exceptional because it is implementing a sanitation and solid waste management program. The Clean Water Act mandates towns to treat wastewater to prevent pollution of rivers and coastal areas. But few municipalities are actually doing it. In Bayawan, it started 10 years ago with this bed of reeds. It is actually a constructed wetland to treat wastewater from the septic tanks of a nearby community of 700 households. The city took a bank loan and received technical assistance to design and construct the wastewater facility using a cost-effective natural treatment process. The treated effluent is reused to water community gardens. We finished the project in less than two years. Uh, so at the price of uh, 10 million pesos for wastewater treatment alone. This wastewater treatment is very effective because it can remove 99.8% reduction of the biological oxygen demand. The main sources of wastewater in the city will be treated under the sanitation plan. At the Bayawan Hospital, a second wetland treatment facility is being constructed to handle the wastewater from the hospital septic tank. And a third decentralized plant will soon be built to treat wastewater coming from the city market. For household sewage, the city operates a septage management program. Customers pay a fee to have their septic tanks emptied once every five years. The collected sludge is dried, treated and turned into fertilizer at this facility. In rural areas, Ecosan toilets, which use no water, are being constructed in schools and communities. All the waste is collected, composted and recycled as fertilizer to protect the environment. For uh, sanitation to be effective and to get the maximum benefit from sanitation, it has to be comprehensive. Sanitation program of the city will not just cover the urban area but all over, even the rural areas, because the water that is going into the city is coming from the upland. Solid waste management is also taken seriously in Bayawan. The city recently completed construction of an environment-friendly sanitary landfill. Garbage is segregated by households and collected separately by city garbage trucks. Materials that can be recycled are recovered. Biodegradable waste is composted to make fertilizer. Only the remaining non-biodegradable trash ends up in the sanitary landfill. Because of what we have done, I have no difficulty in winning the next term because people saw that uh, this is a predictable uh, plan of the city and, and uh, so far it has changed our lives for the better. The city's sanitation and solid waste program proved popular with voters. Mayor Sarania served three terms, the maximum permitted by Philippine law. Since 2010, Bayawan has a new mayor who is continuing the sanitation program of his predecessor. Now is the time to really address the sanitation problem, the environmental problem, uh, not only here in our locality, not only here in the Philippines, but uh, throughout the world. I'd like to convince the local government unit leaders if they could only replicate this, uh, maybe learn from it, and maybe they could uh, fine-tune it to their own particular needs.